Hello, in this tutorial we're gonna instruct how to fix delta error like C1198 and the other connectivity issues on Tom Clancy's The Division Game DLC. So, first of all, this tutorial instructs delta error fix and other connectivity issues on Tom Clancy's The Division game servers on multiplayer, actually. It's most related to U Ubisoft servers, actually, but, but when they fixed it, it auto automatically solves the problem, but sometimes it may be caused by your computer settings. So many GameStopity.com forum users experiencing these kind of pro connection problems when they try to play this game on multiplayer. So we have collected some unofficial workarounds and also official instructions below. Here are some instructions to fix these kind of problems. So first of all, try the, these things. So one is like port forwarding. The second one, changing your computer's firewall and connection settings. And the third one is console commands to restore factory settings. So if it doesn't work, try these steps. Log back into your router to clear out the port for forwarding and notice a firewall in the router. After changing this, firewall and allowing you play and the division through, this would allow you to connect and play finally. Hope it works. If not, please comment below or post your questions on our gamesapid.com forums. So here are the official instructions about these kind of problems on Tom Clancy's The Division game connectivity. So according to the firewall software, start by updating any untruths or personal firewall software that may be installed on your computer. So click on it and update your program. And for third party software, like if you are using Zone Alarm, and Northern Antares, McAfee, Avast, check with the appropriate software vendor for details on updating the software and definitions. So you also need to consider Windows Firewall, which may block the game from accessing the internet. Please note that update your Windows Firewall definitions will need to keep your Windows updates up to date. So like typing your Windows Windows Firewall, so it's uh, currently uh, protected by third-party software, so it's not uh, turned on on our computer, but you have to go into your advanced settings and go to your inbound, outbound rules and look up your game, the division Tom Clancy's Division game, if it's blocked or not. So this is your must do. And the thing is, if updating these programs doesn't solve the issue, you may need to configure the software to allow access to the specific application. This is generally done through the exceptions list, maybe named differently depending on your software. Adding the game as an exception, remember to add the executable for both game and you play. So you have to make those 
kind of games like the division into your um, into your firewalls exception lists or antivirus exception lists so you can find on your uh, antivirus program to make an exception another thing is the ports if following the steps above to update and configure your firewall doesn't resolve the issue it will be nece necessary to forward ports you'll need to forward these ports to your computer's IP address for the best possible connection so for you play PC use these ports forwarding so for game ports use this for UDP and for TCP use these kind of ports directions for configuring network ports are specific to software and hardware being used and can be found by visiting the manufacturer's website like we are using a modem an internet modem and it's like typing this kind of uh, thing in order to access our computer yes this kind of thing so um, another thing is uh, background applications so you may also encounter problems due to applications running in the background on your computer system if you are encountering problems playing online please try closing all running up background applica applications before starting your game you can find these steps for this set this below so just go to your ms config and go to the startup and open task so you can find the startup components and choose some of them or disable all of them in order to fix your and try your connectivity issues like you can disable Skype or other things that you have on your startup so this is disabling startup items right via ms config now this should be seen as a temporary solution and any change can be reworked by returning to the ms config utility and clicking enable all on the startup tab on windows 8 8.1 and windows 10 the startup programs can be switched off directly from from the taskbar so you can do that as you can see and another thing is host file the host file is a small text file which is part of the windows operating system it can be used to route traffic or sometimes block a website to rule this out when dealing with problems exceeding the multiplayer part of the game it should be cleaned or reset the easiest way to clean your host file is by clicking on the fix button on the Microsoft article found here like in this article so this article is very useful to reset your host file and clear it from the system folders going into etc folder and open it then try to change your host file it's kind of like this so you may be blocked some of the ports or IP addresses on your host file so just clear your host file and this is the article for it 
And the, another thing is traffic traveling blocked ports. So there may also be certain restrictions set by your internet service provider ISP. If you continue to have trouble, please contact your ISP for details on any specific restrictions on the previously men mentioned networks. So for USB, USA ISPs. <coughs> So you can contact these kind of Comcast, Time Warner Cable, CenturyLink, ETC, Charter, Verizon, Frontier, Cox. So like this. So thanks for watching us. If you have any other questions, you can write for us and write on our forums about this problem.